Reviewing week one here at SBR Forum Videos, I'm Peter Loshak, and we are talking with a brand new guest to our SBR uh, Videos Game Previews, Tony George, handicapping industry veteran and a uh, real pro. His two websites are uh, TonyGeorgeSports.com, LockerRoomPicks.com, and he's got a brand new show this NFL season, uh, a radio show on the Yahoo Sports Network. Tony George, thanks for being with us. Hey, thanks for having me on again, Peter. Okay, quickly tell us uh, where, we, where can we find uh, this uh, radio show and what time? Hey, 8 o'clock on Sunday mornings, Yahoo Sports Network, over 400 affiliates, and on Cirrus Channel 92. It's, uh, it's a sports talk show with handicappers, myself, Teddy Covers, Brian Leonard, Jimmy Boyd, Ross Benjamin, Joe Gavassi, uh, some of the top names in the Absolutely. Yeah. marketplace, and uh, we're looking forward to giving it a little bit of a Vegas twist and, and representing our handicapping industry with uh, pride on a mainstream network like this and uh, once again that's eight o'clock sunday mornings eastern standard time their nfl lead in sirius channel 92 or yahoo sports radio network near you all right that sounds great for all you morning larks definitely tune in me eight o'clock i'm never up at eight, at eight in the morning on a sunday morning but you know <laughs> i know there are plenty of people who are all right we're going to talk about oakland at indianapolis i'm a little bit interested that you uh, that you requested this game to talk about because uh, i look at this you know this is one of those nfl games with a huge spread we know why because oakland looked terrible in the preseason they're a terrible team uh, you know should indianapolis be a nine and a half point a legitimate nine and a half point home favorite i don't know maybe you take them on a seven point teaser tony george what do you have to say about it well, that's why I was going to say exactly. You stole my thunder there, mm -hmm. Peter. <laughs> is uh, each week on my NFL cards, and I'm a real low volume handicapper. Mm -hmm. I don't believe in, you know, throwing darts at a board and sure. see what sticks. I like I like a low volume type approach. And and each week I'll take a couple of sides and a total and then throw in a two team six point teaser. And mm -hmm. this game here, I'm not willing to lay nine and a half or ten points right. with uh, Indianapolis in their home opener. Clearly the better team. Clearly Oakland has all kinds of problems. This could easily be a 35 to 10 game, 35 to 7 game. It easily could go the other way in terms of being a tight ball game for one reason or another. I think Indianapolis has done a nice job with their defense in the offseason and the preseason. They looked really good. I was impressed with their defense. Prior starting a quarterback is yeah. going to be a problem for them. I guess he's a lesser of two evils because I don't think Matt Flynn is healthy enough to go. I don't think either one of them are a starting quarterback in the NFL, to be honest with you. But this would be a perfect opportunity where I like to do two team six point teasers so I can get 11 to 10 odds. And this would be a great teaser option for somebody to get these guys down to three and a half. I know it's over the fall number of three, mm -hmm. but I'll tell you one thing right now the Colts are at least a touchdown better in this game. I'm not willing to go out on a limb. Uh, even though they're at home, they were six and two against the number last year at home. Uh, and like I said, the left side of that offensive line for uh, Oakland is a mess, and the quarterback's right. going to be a bigger mess. He looked terrible in his last preseason game. So you're not too high on Terrell Pryor. I mean, he does have explosive speed. You know, he might be one of these quarterbacks who can come in and his first two or three games will, you know, look like Superman, then he slows down, then he gets injured, then teams figure him out. But you're not worried that his speed might be able to uh, keep Oakland in the game here. Well, you know what? I think he's going to help Oakland move the chains a little bit, but I just don't think you can have, you know, quote unquote, a dual threat running mm -hmm. back like uh, Pryor in, in a game like this and expect him to carry the entire load on his shoulders without some help. They, right. Their running game's going to be uh, a little weak here with the left side of their line. They're starting left tackles. One of their studs, he's out. Uh, virulent. So, I mean, at the end of the day, I don't think he can carry this team, especially. I know he's got mad skills. Right. I, I don't think he's an RG3 or a Wilson from Seattle, but he's got enough to maybe move the chains a little bit, get the defense spread out. But they can't do that the entire four quarters right. in this football right. game. All right, great analysis. Thanks so much. Tony George from TonyGeorgeSports.com and LockerRoomPicks.com and the brand-new uh, radio show Sunday mornings on the uh, Yahoo Sports Network. Thanks so much, Tony. We'll talk to you again next week.